don't have brain you are not talented you are good for nothing this words we have to hear every day in our life in the school on the way to home in the market and everywhere in the society discriminate the tribal people we had to bear it today i am very proud to stand before you i am even more proud to speak in english in front of you despite the fact that i am a school dropout there are different tribal communities in kerala they include paniya naika kurchar mullukurmar vedar and kanikar each of us have our own language dress code lifestyle and culture we are the indigenous people that means the original inhabitants of the land i belong to paniya tribe and i come from vayana district of kerala up until the 18th century most of the population of vayana were tribes but then many people from different parts of country migrated to vayana we the tribal have a rich culture of sharing everything among ourselves and others unfortunately the people who came from outside exploited our culture of sharing we lost our resources traditions lifestyle forest and land we are facing many problems today the issues of land and education in children are the major problems in our community as a tribal woman i want to share my experience to you i was very happy to join the school when i was child but then how did i become school dropout i went to school with lots of energy however slowly i understand that i am very different from other children that's because i come from a tribal family at the school everybody spoke in malayalam which is not our mother tongue malayalam is the language of kerala region teacher taught in malayalam i couldn't understand anything i remember my malayalam teacher beating me with a cane not for reciting a malayalam poem she made fun of me you are tribe you don't understand anything i was very silent i saw all other children were laughing at me it was very painful i met other tribal children from other classes during our lunch break we will sit together and we will talk in our own language we decided to skip the class to class together and we spent all day play together near the forest and field we used to return home when we hear the evening school bell i continued it until my mother found it out that is how i became school dropout during this period i heard about a drama group in our area i got attracted to it later this drama group people began kanavu an alternative education center i enjoyed kanavu because of community living and very different learning methods i got lots of encouragement to improve my skills i also learned many other skills i learned how to read and write i learned to do martial art music dance agriculture cooking i also got new insights regarding the history and culture of our tribe let me show you a video about kanavu alternative education center <laughs> കഴിഞ്ഞ നൂറ്റാണ്ടിന്റെ അവസാന ദശകത്തിൽ ആരംഭിച്ച ഒരു വിദ്യാലയം 
വിദ്യാഭ്യാസത്തിന്റെ അവസാന ലക്ഷ്യം ഭൂമിയിൽ സമാധാനം ഉണ്ടാവുകയാണ് ഇതുപോലെ കുട്ടിയുടെ ഉള്ളിൽ ജന്മസിദ്ധമായ പല കഴിവുകളും ഒളിഞ്ഞു കിടപ്പുണ്ട് ഇതൊക്കെ ഉണർത്തണം ഈ ഈ കഴിവുകളൊക്കെ തന്നെ വരുന്ന തലമുറകൾക്ക് ഒരു സംഭാവനയായി തീരണം ഭാഷ ചരിത്രം സയൻസ് കണക്ക് തുടങ്ങിയവയെല്ലാം കനവിൽ സ്വന്തമായ രീതിയിൽ പഠന വിഷയങ്ങളാകുന്നു ഇപ്പൊ ജീവിതം വിദ്യാഭ്യാസം തമ്മിൽ തന്നെ അങ്ങനെ ഒരു തിരിവില്ലാത്തതുകൊണ്ട് കരിക്കുലം കോ കരിക്കുലം അങ്ങനെ ഒരു തിരിവ് വരുന്നില്ല എല്ലാ ആക്ടിവിറ്റീസും കരിക്കുലാണ് This is my story. But do you know what happened to my other village friends of my age who did not join the Kanavu alternative school? Some of them became child workers. Some of them lost their hope and they are addicted in alcohol. Some of them, especially the girls, got married at early age. This is the situation of most of the tribal children in Kerala. even today in the education department of kerala says that 0.6% children are going to school drop out but for the tribal children it is 30% at the high school level only a few reach higher education i married a person from veda tribal community in trivandrum when i came to this community i found the veda tribes also have the similar, similar problems in my community in vinad so i want to work with veda tribal community the tribes in northern kerala are officially recognized by the government but veda tribes is not so i started an organization gotra talam gotra talam means rhythm of tribe my organization aims to providing an alternative education to school dropouts in tribal children i will teach them different skills such as music dance handicrafts martial art it will develop their confident and make them self sustainable i want to see a big change in life of tribal children i want to see the tribal children are becoming new individuals i want them proudly say that i am tribe i want to give them awareness about tribal issues and how to take positive step to solve the problems this is the change gotra talam my organization want to see if the tribal children get a good opportunity enough support and encouragement they can become a leader a doctor a teacher and what they want to become i want to give you an example of our creativity in our body and mind positive mindset towards tribal children in my area i believe i can do it thank you